All right, back at the R and E site. Say hello, hon. <laughs> well, Ella's got one coming out of the wall here. We can tell it's got a broken tip, but it's got secondary working on both sides, so it could be a big point. I hope it is. Might just be a tool. But anyway, back down here at the creek in the big hole that red bowling and another rocker base small bowling came out of. And as usual, we're going through where other people had dug before, as you can see. Oh, it fell. Oh, it fell out. What is it? Wow, it's a bowling bubble. It's beautiful, the vase. Oh, God, look at that. Oh, God. Fine. <laughs> oh. oh, man. Wow. Wow, get the water. <laughs> oh, man, look at the notching. God, I can't believe that. It's and it's translucent, honey amber. Oh, God, look at that. Okay, pour some water on there right quick. Man. That's why I keep saying go deep, go deep, go deep. Wow. Beautiful. And see, this point was right below where somebody else had dug. Let me get out of here for some perspective. There. Wow. That's wide. Point out where it was, hon. All right, okay. <clears throat> you can see where other people have dug. This one here. And then I found in here. So that was about... Oh, no, in here, yeah. Yeah, so that was about eight inches below where they quit digging. See, down from here, see? You got to go down. And then... In here, they did not dig in here. That's what I found. Down at the creek site. Yes. God, one more time. Look <laughs> at this point. That's beautiful, honey. Oh, that's that's definitely a Dr. Gomer. <laughs> you see the base, hun? Huh? God, that's beautiful. God, this thing's gorgeous. Oh, honey, <laughs> that's one of the yeah. prettiest bowlings I've seen out of here. That's a big one, no, hun? One. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> In the bottom of the fire iron. Yeah. Such a tiny piece. Hello, rabbit hunt towards here. Huh. Oh my God. <laughs> Not chasing a rabbit. That's a big one, rabbit. Well, R and E Tuesday, uh, February twenty third, two thousand ten. My honey finds a screaming bowling bevel. Well, what is this in here too? Just a little tip damage. Thank God we didn't do it. <laughs> what are you going to do? Find another one? In here or what they did? <laughs> but you can see along this wall where people originally dug the modeled strata. Oh, over here it was almost deep enough. That was dug down about four feet. That was dug about three, and you can see it tapering. Now that's almost natural. The top layer isn't. Oh, okay, there's a good spot. That's what it should look like, pretty much. You have a little topsoil layer, white sandy layer, clay sand, then back into a 
large grain blonde sand and right down there below the bottom is the bottom the clay pan and the sweet spot was right at the bottom of the white sand into the red sand so that's where most everybody dug as you can see right here that's the uh, digging the sweet spot but they didn't do the work they didn't go down deep enough and they didn't get down into the paleo layer drives me nuts they talk about oh this is a woodland or an archaic site no actually it's a everything site you're just not digging deep enough to get to the paleo well anyway enough lecturing for now found a killer point one more look oh there it is <laughs> you can tell which side was facing up more patina Well, that's it for today at the R&E site. Say goodbye. <laughs> Say goodnight, Gracie.